मॉड्यूल सेवन लेक्चर थर्टी सेवन अथेंटिकेशन प्रोटोकॉल इन विंडोज पासवर्ड इज स्टोर इन दम ऑफ हैश वैल्यू इन दिलो पिक्चर वी कैन सी दासवर्ड इज स्टोर इन द सेम फाइल ऑफ ए कंप्यूटर सिस्टम इन दैश फॉर्म वेन द यूजर एंटर द यूजर पासवर्ड कंप्यूटर यूज इज द पासवर्ड एंड जनरेट द हैश वैल्यू विद द सम ऑफ एलग्रिथम and authenticator compare the resulted hash value with the value of hash stored in the same file if both matches the computer allowed the user to log in successfully how authentication works for domain account there is some authentication protocol used in windows operating system for authentication and authorization of user credential there are two types of authentication protocol currently being used in windows ntlm and kerberos when any user enter the username and password authentication protocol responsibility to verify and validation of the credential authentication protocol works on the symmetric key cryptography for encrypting and decrypting of the information in which the same key is used for encryption and decryption all the username and password exist in the active directory for the domain account in the domain controller windows logs all activity related to the failed attempt successful login activity for the user account in the log files before understanding the authentication protocol understand the need for basic security in securing the credential why encryption required for example one client say want to access the resource of one server if client will send the credential of on the wire or in the network might be the credential can be sniffed by the some attacker connected in the same network this attack is known as man in the middle attack because of our poisoning or attacker can directly sniff the traffic from the wire attacker can also modify or reply back to the server with the sniffed traffic the attacker now received the credential of the user account the attacker will submit the credential of the user to the domain controller and authenticate as a user and now attacker can do the any activity on the behalf of the user to secure the communication channel trick encryption is used now user does not need to send any clear text password in the network all the information is encrypted with the user password generated from the hash value hash value is used to generate the or for the encryption in the information now user will send a request to access the resources domain controller will send a challenge to the user the user will use the password hash and encrypt the challenge with the user password and send back to the server the server will use the user password for the decryption and if found the same challenge and the response as the user password is stored in the active directory the directory can decrypt the challenge and can see the response and the challenge if they matches it allows the user to log into the computer now without transferring any credential in the network user successfully authenticated